So on the drive here, we're gonna start at the top of plus 24 yard mark. Wide train to the left by the rough line. And we are going to then I apply one left spin, six and a half bar top spin. This shot has been tested with a wind five and a wind four ball. Uh, it's not tested with luminary at all or wind three ball. Adjust max plus 10 P4. And once we have done that, we shall not push up anything with a POC 6, 7, and 8. But with a POC 5, we push up one ring. We want to have the rubber band just left of the most left triangle. I judge that to be somewhere between, yeah, I would say one and a half ball of left curl. Bounces on the fairway, the ball rolls down the fairway and being very consistent to be around 395 yards. Sorry, 435 yards. Oh my God, can't talk today. 435 yards to 440 yards. What has to be said though, I tried to send it with a, bun with a couple of all balls and didn't really like the inconsistency with that. So I'm laying up, uh, but there's definitely a chance of getting the ball up to uh, around the green if being very unlucky with, if being very lucky with a send it. For the second shot, we are going to use our bullseye by the fringe line, where the fringe meets the fairway. Sorry, fringe meets the green, and then we're going to apply 3.4 backspin is going to be in the end. We're looking to have the top of the white ring to be just by the fringe line, and we want the tip of the ball guideline to be approximately one and a half green square short of pin. So in my opinion, we are a little bit too far here in this video. Sure. It will still be fine as we this year that we will be coming in a little bit too hot now we're gonna have our base at plus two plus sorry plus uh, plus two yeah plus two is going to be 30 percent slider with a 20 percent elevation p3 numbers and we're gonna pull one time over bullseye bounce on the fairway rolls up the green and we're getting it dead center for a lovely eagle Get our guide on patreon.com slash golfclashatomy and look for the ultimate tournament guide packages.